Alright, uh, I'm Epic Eden and this is Dreams of Darkness the game and today we're not going to be focusing on the maze part of the map. We're going to be focusing here at the Forgotten Statue and basically we're going to be working on the crypt back here. It's going to lead to the Valley of the Spider and that's what all we're going to do today. <laughs> not a whole lot. Um... But it should be interesting, and this is going to be a roughed draft, so you have to bear with me. And any input on what you guys think uh, would be appreciated on this part of the map. Anyway, let me get set up for that, and we'll get going. I think, eventually. Here we go. Yeah. 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 Okay, so today I'm a little divided of what I want to do. Tomorrow's Halloween, and I want to do a special uh, with the Halloween texture pack. So in order to keep in tradition with what I want to do and with Halloween, I think I'm going to work on the crypt today, and the crypt is the beginning just before the, the Valley of the Spider. Also, uh, I was told <laughs> that uh, because we're going into the Forbidden Forest here, or jungle more like it now, um, I'm not a Harry Potter fan, but uh, I was told that the Forbidden Forest is a Harry Potter thing. <laughs> Understand that this game is older than Harry Potter. <laughs> so, <laughs> a lot older. Um, so... My inspiration did not come from Harry Potter. Um, I've actually never seen Harry Potter. So, coincidence. All right, so here we go. Let's make a path back to the crypt. I'm not sure I want to do the crypt. Uh, keep in mind, I did not do this in the original version of this game. So, I'm kind of playing this by ear. So we're going to make a path that goes around, around the outside, around the outside. Let's get rid of that, get rid of that. And I see I'm going to have to do some, excuse me, oh, that was, that was nice, that was juice. There we go. So it looks like I'm going to have to do some manipulating here. Not really manipulating, but sprucing up. Because I don't like that. There we go. Now I'm happy. Happy, happy, happy. All right, let's keep going around this. And the path will be broken here because it's old. I'm not going to take out any water. It's just old. Just an old, old path here. I don't think I'm going to take that out either. Don't know. <clears throat> I don't know what I'm gonna make the script look like. And I don't think I'm gonna add the Crypt Keeper. And yes, the Crypt Keeper is from Tales from the Crypt. <laughs> Inspirations. That one is a fact. But I don't think I'm gonna make the Crypt Keeper in this. I don't know how I'll make him work. And this, yeah, I see a little bit of path in there. So let's go ahead and get to work on this. I'm just going to dump everything I don't need off here. I'm going to need some mossy cobblestone, some mossy cobblestone slab, um, probably some mossy cobblestone stairs. It's actually on the other side of there. 
and we'll work with that. See what we got. So, how are we gonna make this happen, Captain? Should I go something along the lines of this? And I don't know how deep this is gonna go. So basically, I know nothing. I'll be honest. Don't know what it is I'm looking for here. It's just going to be a crypt. Don't know. No, there's gonna have to be something there. I don't know. This will probably be covered all in vines as well. Not sure. Not 100% sure. So it's going to be pretty simple. Let's see what do we have here. And for doors, it's too bad we don't have old style doors. I probably won't even put any doors on there. Let's not say we did. Because they don't have any. Nothing old style. Um, what if we went up here? Not sure how this is going to work. We'll see. Nothing fancy. Just an old crypt. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see. And should I go one more up or should I flatten this out? Something like that. For now. So it's an old crypt. We'll, we'll spruce this up later. Yeah, so I'm going to do an, a Halloween special, and I will be doing everything with... Uh, the Halloween texture back tomorrow. Looks kind of neat. And I'm thinking, let's do some glass here. Hmm. Not my favorite, but, uh, We'll think of something here. So we're going to do one more up. And we'll change these stairs. I just want to use these temper. And we'll come in and, and make it all blend in together. Just want to get our tunnel started. Let's 
see what we can come up with here. And see what we can get started with the uh, Valley of the Spider. See if we can't do something. Oh, there I go. Just, just bust it all out. There you go. Too much, too much juice. Give it all I have, Cap. If I give you more, should blow. Like the Scotty impersonation. Star Trek. Although I grew up on Star Trek, which is weird, because it was much later. I wasn't born in the 60s, but... Uh, that's all I had growing up military. Yes, sir. <laughs> all right, uh, here we go. And I kind of want this to go a little deep, because that's the ground right there. Or not the ground, but yeah, yeah, the surface. Let's call it what it is. Let's call it the surface. Let's Let's just go one more back. Can I? Is it going to allow me? It is going to allow me. If it's going to allow you, take it. But it's going to make it light. Because, uh... That is a... Uh... Wow. Well, really? The nerve of it. And right here, that's where it's going to end. Right there. Well, I make it end right there. And that is the entrance to the crypt. Ooh. You were expecting something special? <laughs> like I said, we'll come back and we'll... Uh, we'll make this all nice and neat. Something special. Because beyond this... Really... Oh, the evilness of it. So it begins. And I'm going to go down at least one more then. If it's going to treat me like that, I have to go down one more. And this is going to be path too, because I don't want mobs spawning here. And I'll explain why shortly. that. Okay, so can I take these out? Yes, and put in there we go. A little bit better. And take this out. Take this out. And, see, I already screwed up, because I know I'm going to take that out. Alright, time to get a little interesting here. So this is going to open up, and i got to decide how much is going to open up. So what was... Oops, don't do that. Oops. What was the distance there? That was only one, one, one. That's it. Can we live with that height? See, I don't like to be... F we're going to go down further. Yeah, we're going to... Yeah, I don't want to be limited. Because I want to be able to change this up how I want to. I don't want... I don't want... I don't want to be told what to do. You know, I'm a grown man. <laughs> I want to make my own decisions here. Create my own destiny. 
So let's go one, two. Let's take this back a little bit before we actually open it up. Because this area, I gotta figure out how I'm gonna light it up just, uh, just a little bit, not too much. So what I'm gonna want, I want that height right there. Yep, that's what I want. And yeah, leave it to me to do something dopey. I'm gonna do something dopey. Oh no, okay, I got it right. I like that height. I'm happy with that. I can live with that. And we'll take this out to five right now. It's just three. Yeah, and the next uh, Halloween intro, it's not going to look like we did much because now we're working underground. So I do my little map intro. Thank you, Quiet Mike, for calling me out on that episode's back. All right, uh, yeah, it's not going to look like we did much. So let's go two more. And then we're going to open this puppy up. And we're going to do some fancy schmancy stuff. And it's going to be the Valley of the Spider. Which I got some good plans. We'll see if it works. We'll put it into effect. We have yet to have an episode wasted. Except for the Pyramid episode. <laughs> Where we actually had to go back and replan. But even then it wasn't a waste because we got our layout. We got our design. We knew what we were going to do. And now we're going to make it happen, Captain. Alright. This is where it's going to open up. And I want this height, and it's going to open up by two on each side, so that'll give us seven. One, two. Did I just open up three? I did, didn't I? Alright, we'll open up three then. I don't care. I don't care. I probably did it to put the wall. Let's see what it looks like when I do it again in this darn gravel. Raise your hand if you like gravel. Hey, remember this this mossy cobblestone. I'm just I'm just temporarily putting all of it mossy. It's going to open up like this. As soon as I get this started, we're going to start doing what I've been dreaming about. Yeah, we can live with that. Yeah. That's where it's going to get interesting. Okay, so let's go ahead and start getting rid of all of this. We're going to make a good long path. And again, I could just be doing a fill command, but I don't want to. Let's make life easier. Let's get ready to rumble. Night vision, three minutes. That way we can see nice. All right. Put our cheaters on. So there's going to be a wall on either side, and uh, we're going to have a surprise for players coming through this area. Suddenly the game gets more difficult. 
and it's kind of a puzzle and kind of just a lucky find you can actually get through this part without even fighting or running for your life screaming like a little girl I apologize to any little girls I offended out there but uh, yeah we're going to play with the player's mind a little bit through this because it's going to be creepy, especially in VR. Oh, this would be so creepy. Yeah, I know. I'm, no, I'm making it suspenseful. If you stay tuned to the end of the video, but wait, there's more. <laughs> there's so many videos out there. It's like, it reminds me of the, the news uh, just before, uh, you know, like the 8 o'clock news. Next on the 8 o'clock news, young boy saves dog from drowning, blah, 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 blah. And then... Uh, they start playing the news, and they play it the last, like, 10 seconds of the news, and it was nothing. <laughs> Save dog from drowning in his own water dish. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> uh, that's what YouTube reminds me of now. I'm not going to start venting, but there's so much of that out there. And I will state it right here in the middle of a video where no one will ever see it. If anyone ever asked me who is the worst YouTuber on YouTube, are you guys ready for this? Adventure. I don't know if you've ever heard of him. He is the worst YouTuber. Oh, what a piece of crap that guy is. Oh, I cannot stand that guy. I don't even know him and I don't like him. Oh, but if I was ever asked that question, which I'll never be asked who's, who's the worst YouTuber on YouTube, that, that would definitely be number one, the worst YouTuber on YouTube. What a piece of crap that guy is. Okay, so let's do this. It's the, it's the juice talking. Gotta watch out for that cranberry juice. Make you cranky. Alright, here we go. So this came to me in a dream. <laughs> so I don't know if it's gonna work. It may or may not. And we'll run out of my night vision. Great. Gonna have to... Drink me some more juice. There we go. <laughs> and God said, turn that light out. <laughs> Lights out, inmates. <laughs> okay. Um, so we're going to make all this because we don't want mobs spawning down here at all. We'll have our own mob spawning. And can anyone take a wild guess what kind of mob this is going to be? Hint. Come on. It's in the name. All right, uh, if you don't know the name by now, I'm not going to tell you. I've already said it several times. You should already know. So you should guess what kind of mobs will be down here. Do you guys want to know who my second least favorite YouTuber is? Stay tuned until the end of the video, because I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> my second most uh, uh, hated YouTuber is really... Uh, I, I wouldn't say he's like major, but he's pretty big. I mean, he's got uh, millions, mil over a million subscribers, and I cannot stand him. Ugh. And I would probably catch a l not too much. I don't think I'd catch that much flag for it. Um, but yeah, his fans would would eat me up and they would hate me forever. So that will have to be my little secret. And I have a third one and I have a fourth one. And But I also have ones I really, really like. And more than likely, you've never heard of them. Because like I said, I like uh, smaller, smaller peeps which I think are a lot better than the bigger ones, but uh, there are some. There's a, there's a couple of big ones out there that I do like. I won't say there's a lot, but there there is a couple out there that are really, really good. Um, and I needed that that I just took away. All right. Why am I doing that? Why did I just do that? That was silly. And I probably have some on this side too, don't I? 
Always cleaning up after myself. Okay, oh, that's, that's a lot of mossy cobblestone right there. Uh, drink of juice. 24 minutes in. Not too bad. So that's about halfway. I wonder how many of you actually watch the whole thing in one sitting. I, I, I don't even do that. I like uh, wake up in the morning in terms of uh, uh, one of the videos is uh, goes live or uh, published. And I watch 20, 20 minutes before I even get out of bed. And uh, sometimes I cringe at myself, but uh, sometimes it's all right. But uh, yeah, and then I'll have to go down and have a cup of coffee and maybe watch a little bit more. Uh, and the reason I do it is just quality control. I want to make sure that uh, the video uploaded right. And that's the final time I watch it. One, one, one of these days, I'll go back and watch my very first uh, YouTube video, which I believe was... Let me think here. That would have been my structure block, building with structure blocks. That was my very first video. And it actually wasn't that bad. I think my next 30 to 40 videos were horrible. And then I have a bunch, a few, a few in between that were really bad. Um, I have yet to have a great episode where I look at it and go, man, that was good. I nailed it. Uh, one day I will, and I'll, I'll make sure I will cycle that one through. So whenever I get a video that has thousands of views, it's probably me that I've watched it over and over and over. Uh, other than that, yeah. Subpar. But I'm trying, I'm trying here. Alright, okay, so... Oh, I don't know if I wanted to take that one. Yeah, I did. I don't care, I'll just fill this all with mossy cobbles. Now. Who cares? Judge me. Okay, so, this is the wall. And I don't know how deep it's gonna go. time do I have on there? A minute? A minute on my night vision. I should put eight minutes, but all right. This is where it's going to take me a little bit of time. Because I'm going to build this, and later on I have to come back through when I put in the lighting system. Because there's going to be a some kind of secret place, if you find it, that uh, you can actually trigger the lights down here and no mobs will spawn and it's just kind of a free passage. If you don't do it, either you're going to have to run or you'll be down here fighting for your life. And chances are you won't make it. So running would probably be your best option. But there's going to be some trickery. That was a quick minute. That's a good way to time myself there. So then this should last till eight minutes and thirty or thirty minutes and thirty seconds of the video. It's a good way to time it. Well, minus intro. So I think I can start this as soon as I get this done. And it's not gonna matter what this is. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know, I don't really have to, for the sake of time-wise, I don't have to lay out this whole thing the way I'm doing it. I can just do one little section at a time. Oh, nice. There you go. Screw it up there. Way to go. I don't have to fill this in either. And I'll just take that one out just for good measure. Put one there just for good measure. If I didn't screw up, you guys would have nothing to laugh about. Alright, so this is where it's going to get tricky. This is where I'm going to need my, my half slaps. And I, how well this is going to work, I don't know. I'm crossing my fingers. Like I said, I, I wasn't literally having a dream about this, but I thought of this while I was 
daydreaming what's the word I'm looking for okay so you remember the way I did the wall out there this is gonna be no a bit different different in how I do it um down up no that's up Oop. let's just go right there let's just and then this way it doesn't have to be the same exact thing this can can be down yes yeah, so this can be the opposite just just for giggles and poops Oop, there it is Oop, there it is all right shaka laka shaka laka um, is that far enough? One more. Bam. Okay. So, just so we can get the look of this, and let's say this is like this. Like so. It doesn't have to be... I may come back in here, like I said before, but I want half slabs. Nothing else. No stairs. No... That was three minutes already? <laughs> <laughs> Time flies. Um, okay. So I don't want it too obvious or too open. I do want things like this once in a while. I want things like this. And let me get out. Because if you didn't guess that the mob is going to be a spider, come on now. You're not paying attention. So... No. No, 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 no. All right. Uh, we can do things like this. Like that. Like that. There we go. We can do little things to liven this thing up. I will stop. What? What? Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Tell me. <laughs> Don't call me a dummy. And we can do little things like this. Like so. Uh, let me just look. Support Trump 2020. Those are my messages on my phone. Um, okay. Here we go. Something, yeah. We're just doing goof around. Now, let me just finish this off, and then we'll get right into what it is I'm trying to do. No, I don't need to do that. Just need to do that. Don't need to do that. Okay. Do, 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 do. You're not fully clean unless you're zest fully clean. <laughs> I'm nuts. Okay, so now I'm going to get into the idea of what it is I'm trying to do. So once you go in here, there's going to be a long passage. And... You're not, it's going to be dark back here unless you trigger the lights. And if you trigger the lights, you will trigger, well, you will de trigger. I don't know how to say that's three minutes again. My goodness, and my timer, I think, stopped. No, it's still going. Um, okay, cave spiders. Now, whether you know, whether you don't know, um, because my son reminded me that cave spiders can go through half slabs. So, what's going to be on the both sides of this wall are cave spider, uh, spider spawners. Um, and there's going to be a lot of them. So, there will be spiders galore just popping up in here, creating all kinds of problems for the player. And you won't be able to see them through uh, 
through these little cracks and they will be literally everywhere. So the cave spiders will spawn on there. Now, I'm I'm not sh I'm I'm pretty sure I might have to move these back further because they might spawn out here, but I want them to spawn out there and as you're coming through I just want cave spiders coming out of these cracks at you, you know, and it's going to be really dimly lit in this area, so you're going to catch them, and in VR, the spiders coming out of the uh, the little cracks there is, is going to be pretty intimidating. And we'll test this a few ways, or a few times, uh, so this will change several times. Uh, we may spend a whole episode once we get this all built, just working on getting that mechanic of the game or getting the mechanics of the game to work. Because remember, I'm doing this vanilla, the no mod commands. I'm not, I'm not using command blocks to, to bring in the mobs at this point. Right now, I'm just using regular spawners. And uh, yeah, we're gonna see how that works. And I, and I think uh, the way I've been planning it, I think it's gonna work. It's gonna work out just fine. And it should be really, really creepy. And like I said, especially in VR. This is this this game right here um, is more tailored to VR than anything else. So just keep that in mind. I don't know why I'm putting this back here. I'm just going to put it back here. I may even decorate some spider webs. I don't I don't know. Our cobwebs will come from spider webs. I don't know. I don't know. But I may just do that just for because I can. So, yeah, we have that, but see, I don't want spiders coming through here. I want to force them through the cracks. I think it'd be really, really cool and really, really creepy, especially when you can hear them. But I want to make it, perhaps, maybe what I'll even do, I'll take it a step further, and we can make cobwebs hang down so you can't just run straight you know what i mean uh it won't be a maze here we can make it a maze from the like if they're hanging down you know what i mean we can make it a maze through here depending how cluttered it'll make it you know so oh you get well i'm in creative so it won't happen that way but yeah you get stuck in there so you got to be kind of crafty and you know what i mean not a maze to block it all off like we can make all this connect something like that you know just just make it connect make it look neat um just so it, it you can't just book it you know <laughs> it's like i'm i'm gone <laughs> you same boat uh not not like that but uh make it a, a, a challenge so i think that would be a lot of fun i think i think players would would really have a a lot of fun. Now we want to put a block there because we don't want to see the spawner anywhere. We, we don't want the player to see the spawner. But we definitely want the bottom ones, these ones, because we want the spider to see you as the player. Yeah, we definitely want this the spider to see you. See, we can put another spawner boop, right here and have plenty of spawners. Mm, I don't think we can put it there. I think we can actually see that spawner. Yes, we can. We don't want to put it there. But uh, hopefully now you see what I'm laying down, and I think it'll be a lot of fun for the player. Because uh, danger lurks around every corner. on this game. Yeah, danger lurks around every corner on this game. Like I said, it'll be pretty dark in here, so you won't pick it up. It looks kind of bleh right now, but we'll, we'll, we'll work on it. Because they were just uh, laying the foundation. So let's go ahead and jump out of here for now. Maybe during our Halloween special, we'll uh, 
we'll finish this up. I haven't figured out what the Halloween special is going to be, guys. It's probably not going to be some big major thing. I just know I'm going to use a texture pack. And that's basically all I know as of right now. And I just realized I can't... <laughs> I can't really decorate this thing. I can put cobwebs there. That's about it. Well, poo. I was hoping for a little bit more. Here I was. I was dogging Mojang for their little crappy uh, uh, temple. I don't know, that's what I'm going to call that now, a crappy temple. <laughs> and I make a crappy uh, crypt keep uh, entrance. Oh, well. <laughs> so let's make it. Yeah. We're going to spruce all this up and let it grow on its own. This will be a lot of this will be covered up by that vine as you come down. It'll be interesting. And I should put it here as well. Somehow, some way. No, I can't, can I? Because that is. Yeah, that's in light. We don't want that. So, as for right now, we'll, we'll just make it this way. But uh, yeah, there'll be some light. It'll be, you know pretty dark. I don't know if you guys can see this as well as me. I use to keep my uh, lighting. Um, I think at default is where I keep my lighting. I don't, when I play, I don't, I don't turn up my bright uh, brightness so I can see better. So it gives me an advantage and stuff like that. So sometimes a player versus player, I can stink pretty bad because I don't do that. But, uh, yeah. Silly me, huh? I know. All right, so let's, uh, let's, I don't know if we're going to push this back, so I really don't want to, to, uh, sit here and goof around on this wall. What I'm hoping, like I said, is I'm hoping that the spiders will spawn on this side, and then you get their attention, they can see you through the blocks, and they will come out at you. Yeah, I could be wrong, they could all just end up back here, piled up, having a little party by themselves, completely ignoring you. Thus, really creating havoc in the game by doing nothing. <laughs> creating a lot of sound. But we'll do, we'll do something cool with this, the cobwebs to force you from from uh, just heading in one direction. You know, we'll make it to where you have to find yourself. And you can find yourself, oh, I gotta find my way back, you know. But not maze, too much of a maze. Just, just enough to make you, uh, which way, this way, which way, that way, you know, left and right. Not a hundred percent sure, and this is looking horrid right now. This looks absolutely horrid. Yeah, not what I envisioned. Yeah, it's gonna take a lot of work, a lot of work. So let's. Uh, do I want to continue? I almost don't want to continue this right now. I'm not feeling it. I'm feeling what I'm. I'm laying down. Let's. 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 Um. Let's just goof around with this. And let's say... I don't know. Uh, let's take this out. We don't need this for now. This is nonsense. Absolutely nonsense. Let's... Um, let's go up this wall right here. We're going to put in some lighting. Just to see what it is we got to work with for lighting wise, because we don't want to make it too too bright. Oops, yep, leave it to me. We don't want to make it too bright, so we we can use some soul lanterns, some chain, because you know I like chain. Cha cha chain. And there goes my. We got some soul lantern in there. So let's go. One, two, three, four, five. And we'll do the same thing here. Except this time we'll put in the soul lantern first. Let me just double this up. I can't see it, so I'm guessing. And I keep guessing wrong. There we go. I just spam clicked. So, 
Yes, sir. So let's say something to this extent. It's going to be a pretty long path. So, so what I say, I said one, two, three before the next one. So f one, two, three, four, five. What? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I'm sorry, I went five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I'll spam it again. I don't care. All right. So let's see what happens when I place a stair the wrong way. When I let's turn these bad boys on. But first, to test. I didn't have to put those lights on because because I am in peaceful. All right, cave spider. I believe this is red one. Sp uh, spider spawner. Uh, let's take another guess at this red thing over here. Cave spider. All right, let's pop that in there. Pop that in there. Pop that in there. Pop. Pop that in there. Let's get rid of these lights and all that. Oh, jeez. Just can't stop from screwing up. I was born to screw up. Born in Alabama. I'm going to die in Alabama. <laughs> Here we go. I apologize for anyone from Alabama. Oh, look. Oh, that's that's because it's... Oh, I don't know. Can I see it through there? Nope. All right, I can live with that. I just want to do that. If they come over the wall, but, uh, just as long as they don't. I want to force them to come through the little gaps. Okay, let's take it off of... Uh, let's take it off of creative. No, we're going to keep it on creative. We're going to put it on hard because we want some spawns. There we go. I could hear spiders. Oh, look at them come. I love it. Oh, did they spawn on the other side? Oh, look at them come through there. That's awesome. The Valley of the Fighter. I love how they're just coming out there. There, oh, look at that one up there. <laughs> uh, and that one kind of spawned in right up against the wall. That was kind of weird. That's still kind of cool, though. Oh, look at that guy. He's just hanging out in there. And as soon as they see you, see, right? The, you see the red eyes? They're going to see you. They're going to come out of there. And remember, they give you poison. Oh, this is going to be... How many are stuck back here? Well, remember, I'm in creative, so... Oh, it's not too bad. They're making their way through. So, I'm in creative, so they're not coming after me. But, yeah, they did. Let me... One more time. Let's go back to settings. Uh, let's put ourselves in peaceful. Get rid of those spiders. And settings. I should have a command block for this, so I could do this really quick. But let's see how many. Oh, that's kind of cool. So I may have to push the spawner back a little bit. You know, like two blocks or something like that, and just block it in so you can't see it. Come on, spawn something in. I want to see... <laughs> They're actually going around. We'll see. Because remember, there's going to be the same amount of spawners on the other side, so they're really going to be coming through. Oh, in VR, this is going to be awesome. And what I may do... Well, no, I have lights on both sides, just like I have it there. So you can actually see in here. So it's not completely pitch black. Maybe I won't have so many holes either. I don't know. We'll see, but we'll 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 do a bunch of stuff. There'll be a bunch of webs in here. Like I said, uh, there'll be webs kind of blocking you from being able to run straight. It's not going to be a maze of webs. You know, they have to follow a certain pattern. It's just not going to allow you to go in any kind of a straight line. You know, if you go off to the one side, it, there'll be something in your way. 
But if you get caught up in those webs, ooh, you're going to be in trouble. <laughs> They're going to eat you up. Um, but, oh, let me, let me take you, let me take you on a little tour. Not to be mistaken with the Tour de France, but a tour, nonetheless. Um, up here, oh, if I can get out of here, let me, before I get overrun by spiders, let me explain what's going to happen somewhere somewhere around here i'm going to reward the player for exploring um which means there's going to be a button somewhere somewhere there's going to be a button and if you push that button it's going to turn on the lights down here and by that i mean back here there will be rows of lights and it will turn off all the spawners. And I'm not going to write a command for that. I'm going to just do it really simple. So we'll do that. I'll be recording it when we do it. I'll run some redstone. So it'll be, yes, it'll be our first redstone, um, our first redstone anything in the game. Yeah, I don't know why that was hard to say. But uh, yeah, it'll be the first time that we did redstone. And it should be interesting. I almost want to make... See, I want it kind of light here. That way, if you come in the day. But when you first start the game, I never mentioned this. When you first start the game, it'll be thunder and raining. And you don't see too much when it's thunder and raining. So, when you see the statue. So, it's really difficult. But the thunder makes gives it that atmosphere. Um, and there shouldn't be anything here spawned. Um, but there's not much that can spawn in anywhere. So the first night is kind of, except here, if you far, wander out a little bit too far and come back in here, yeah, you can have mobs that have spawned in here. But uh, other than that, it, it should be pretty pretty chill first night. Um, and players can just sit back and kind of enjoy figuring out what's what. Anyway, um, yeah, like I said, next <laughs> next video coming in, it's going to be like, what did you do? Uh, you know, if you miss this video, uh, you'll be looking at it going, well, you didn't do much. Um, yeah, we got our, we got our, our crypt, which looks like, I like the door, Andrew, you know, with the doors, because it's so old, but, uh, yeah, other than that, mm. subpar, Eden subpar, got a nice little path, that way when you get here, um, it kind of leads you, you know, I'm holding your hand, you know, <laughs> saying, go this way, uh, and, Somewhere in here too, there'll there'll be a there'll be a electron uh, electron, and I probably murdered that word, but uh, explaining what this is, and there'll be one here at the crypt or down there explaining what's beyond this point. And this is not the only way to get to into the uh, Forbidden Forest. You can get there from this way from that map. You can get there several different ways to get into the Forbidden Forest, um, but this way is probably the shortest way to get into the middle. You know, you'll be really far in into the you know in into the uh forest because the forest could be huge it's, it's gonna be massive um but this will be one of the the easier ways to get in there but anyway yeah we're gonna go ahead and wrap that up uh if you enjoyed this episode please give it uh, a like and if you really really liked it hey subscribe especially if you haven't already if you've already subscribed Please don't do it, but I was going to say, unsubscribe, resubscribe, don't do it, but, <laughs> you know. Anyway, I'm out of here, uh, and I'll see you guys uh, on Halloween, and we'll do a Halloween special. All right, see you next uh, video.